Hey guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. Today we will learn about the voltage sensor or the voltage monitor module within the multisim. As we know that in multisim, we do not have a lot of microcontrollers option. Like there isn't any sort of huge big series or Raspberry Pi or Arduino. Or even there isn't any sort of new and highly sophisticated sensors. So in order to cope with, we have to rely on a simple voltage sensor or voltage monitor. So for it, you need to go to your components library. And here we need to click on all groups. Here you can see that we have an option for voltage underscore monitor. And we can see a 2.63 voltage monitor here. How it used to work is very simple. That ground pin is being is must be connected with the ground. And reset pin must be connected with an indicator or LED. And V positive. V positive with the input voltage. When the input voltage is greater than 2.63 volt is mentioned here under the module. When it is greater than 2.63 then we get a logic 1 on the reset pin. And when it is less than 2.63 we get a logic 0 on pin number 2. So how it used to work? Let's get started. So we will take our DC power supply. We need to take our ground. And we need to take our probe. Probe is for output. It used to work on like a 5 volt, 2.5 volt, and it can tolerate a bit of voltage. And what about ground pin? Ground pin must be connected with the ground take. What about V positive? Yes, we can. Okay, yeah, we can connect it with the positive of the battery and the lower end of the battery are connected with the ground. Now we will write 1 volt here and we will see that either we get any sort of. Uh... Okay, wait. Okay, now we need to write here too. Now we can see that we are not supposed to get any sort of voltage. Okay, so when it is like 2.3, we can see no voltage, and here 2.4, no voltage, and 2.5, then again no voltage when 2.62 again we are not observing any sort of logic one now we will go for 2.63 volts nothing and when we will make it 2.64 we got our value. You also observe that when we put one, it is also going to blink. So we will test it for less than two volt as well. So at 1.9, it's do not use to blink. At 1.8, no. At 1.7, nothing. At 1.6, it's not blink, uh, not blinking. Okay, so at one point like four, we will see what will happen. No blinking at all. At 1.2 and 1.1, I'm just uh, observing the 
lowest value on which it used to respond uh, improperly now at one volt it used to blink but it's okay from 1.12 to 2.62 it do not use to blink but when it is higher than this voltage it used to blink so so our voltage voltage must be greater than like uh, like uh, 2. Point, must be greater than 2.62 volts so hopefully you got the concept that how we can use the voltage monitor or voltage sensor within the multi sim so thanks for visiting our channel